Hey, what's good, y'all? You know what it is. Say what? I don't really know. Just uploaded the first episode, celebrating with some good, good, you know what I'm saying? Not this good, good. I'm chilling in the studio, and then something come across the recommendation side on the screen. What do I see? Something that I need to talk about right the fuck now. For hip hop, for the culture, for the motherfucking West Coast, we got Too Short and E-40 verses. Yes, a whole lot of yes. But that's not the main thing I wanna touch on. You know what I'm saying? First thing, check it out, y'all. I survived 2020 again. <laughs> Have you? You know what I'm saying? Hey, get this joint at doitalldigital.com. Hit up my store. $20.20, 20 cents, 2020. You know what I'm saying? But if you above XL, it's gonna be a little more. Anyway, uh, it's what this verse thing has turned into. You know what I'm saying? I was just about to go in on this Breakfast Club interview with uh, Charlemagne, Envy, 40, and Short. I was just about to go in on the interview, and right away, Charlemagne and Envy was promoting the envelope to shit talking. Talking about, hey, you think you can handle his slick mouth? You know what I'm saying? Man, why y'all gotta do this shit? Between the bloodthirsty fans and a lot of the hip hop media, y'all done spent this whole celebrity versus thing into something that it's really not. If Short and 40 didn't already know and believe there was legends in the game, besides being close friends and grown men, man, them other niggas could have started some bullshit. And that's what I want to talk about. All this versus shit is supposed to be a good thing. It could have been the start of something greater than what it is now. But between hip hop media and all the bloodthirsty fans, Y'all done turned its beautiful innocence into an ugly ass hoe. What Swiss and Timbo gave us was dope as hell, man. Two friends talking that playful smack, playing hit after hit for the fans. Man, that was beautiful. But because of all the side talk and the who is better than who and whose lyrics can't fuck with who and so and so and they style is this and that and blah, blah, blah. Man, these artists, these friends, these people are afraid to play because not only have the fans fuck shit up, but the media as well turn this shit into grudge matches. And then because of the view of the world, some artists might take it to places they don't really need to go. You know what I'm saying? I would have loved, I would have loved to watch Tip and 50 do their thing. You know what I'm saying? Could have been cool as shit. 50 could have been like, hey, yo, Tip, what can you do with this? You can find me in the club, bottle full of bug. And then Tip would be like, I most definitely have something that could match the qualities of your integrity. You know what I'm saying? Money, hoes, cars, and clothes. That's how all my niggas roll. You know what I'm saying? Shit would have been live as fuck. Anyway, I don't want to make this too long. I just want to point out that this celebrity verse shit is not an act of war. You know what I'm saying? It really is not. It's really for us, the fans. We want to hear the hits again. Played back to back with another's playlist that more than likely accents both participants. So let's get it back to what it should have been. So I'm looking forward to watching Short and 40 do their thing. I believe they're going to show the rest of you motherfuckers how it's to be done. You know what I'm saying? You want to battle, battle? Take your ass to the arena and get in with them heavy bars. Say what? I don't really know. Say what? I don't really know though. Ready to go go like that Animaniac Dodo. Can't find my phone, someone call me on the moto. Shh, I'm on a mission for the ring like Frodo. Got myself together, now pitching me for the promo. Part of your one solo, red cup and it YOLO. Sometimes I run quick and lean long on slow mo. Gordo, take it to go, never on Coco. Welcome to the show, what it gon' be on? From elsewhere, don't know, but it gon' be on. If you ain't heard about it, check it, it's over there. I don't really know too much like what I know beyond. Say when they come around asking about Jay, I'm leaving links in the description, it's on you to play. I ain't wanna gossip about it, but I feel like I heard, so check that after you like it. Subscribe to me first. Say what? Really know. I just might mention it on the show. Say what? I don't really know, so I'm leaving links in the description down below. Say what? I don't really know. Seriously, that's the name of what you're watching. Say what? I don't really know. That's the info show. Glad you stopped. Say what? I don't really know. Say what? I don't really 
right now. 